Seventh pitch of the at bat. Swing and a miss. Was an hour. Turbo sinker. Might have hit Altuve in the knee if he didn't swing it. That ball moved two feet, Joe. It, it almost hit him in his back knee. Uh, if he doesn't swing, it would. Look at the movement. Look at the pitches. And strike three called. He got him looking on a fastball. And that is a strike. He tried to check. And yeah. that is strike three. And seen he tried to hold up. He had gone into the count. Pitch to VR. Swung on and missed. He got him with a changeup. Foul tip back. Two to Stevie Wilkerson here. Looking to continue his groove. And he gets him. Yarbrough's got another strikeout. His fourth of the day. And two down here in the sixth. Door and just showing off that command again. And he got it. He struck him out. We got Kind of fortunate with the pitching staff we get to cover. Strike three call right at the top of the zone. And a wave and a miss. He got him to chase and ahead of a hitter. And then watch how this breaking ball expands. I mean, look at that thing just take off. Even in slow motion, it's got a quick break. Yikes. Swing and a miss. Hicks out. Ten starts so far in. Morton's pitch. Breaking ball. Swung and a miss. Strike three. One, two. He got him. A cut and a miss on the breaking ball. And he got him looking. Strike three called. Fastball top of the zone. With a man at third. And a swing and a miss. And he got the corner that time. Show front. And he goes around. Charlie Morton getting the job done. And that's a strike call. And a cut and a miss. This curveball kind of backdoors it. And you see that kind of an emergency hack there. I think Dwight Smith Jr. realized that ball started off away and he thought, uh oh, this is coming back. So he just throws. Only struck out 66 times this year. And he strikes out here. They'll have to throw to first to make it official. Here's your fastball down and in. Here's your fastball down and in. Oh, yeah. right below the zone. And, and so hard to lay off. The 2-2 two -two to Correa. Got him looking. It's a pitch that's almost unhip. You know, I would think about using glass now tomorrow. Strike. Strikes Brantley out. He strikes out Moreland. Gonna go through the whole thing, but the Rays, you get the 10 strikeouts, and, and there's there's everybody wins. And figured they had a shot. And so they've added some pieces. There's a high fly ball. Deep to center, Kiermaier to the wall, and he got it! Kiermaier grabbed that one against the wall. Wow, what a catch. I mean, I, I'm stunned right now, and I've seen some amazing plays from Kevin Kiermaier. This right here might be the best catch I have ever seen him make. Garcia goes all the way over from right field to congratulate him on that. He challenged the wall here. You can hear him. Coming up here, knows exactly where the wall is. That ball is up top. Gets every piece of that vertical out of his body as he can. Look at this. Look at that catch. Holding on to the ball after you crash into the wall that hard. That's something special. Great landing. And Pham, Tommy Pham over immediately. I thought Torinos was going to come off the mountain and give him a hug. <laughs> you see him take off his hat. Look at this jump, full extension. And you know what else? He knows exactly where the wall is. You know how hard it is to judge where the wall is when you're going full speed, tracking a ball off the bat, slamming into that wall with right shoulder, hat comes off. I mean, that is, yep, I agree, Yanni.
I'm with you, man. Hats off. Hats off.